Well, hello. Uh, my name is Ramzi Nasser. I'm uh, age 38 and I'm from mixed Palestinian Dutch descent. My father is Palestinian, my mother is Dutch, but I was uh, born and raised in Holland. Completely Dutch education. I was brought up uh, completely Dutch and I'm by profession I'm an actor as well as a poet and a writer and a director. But in this case I would like to tell you something about my poetry. I, in Dutch I published about four to, no, five volumes of poetry so far. I started publishing in 2000 and I have one volume of poetry uh, in English which is called Heavenly Life. It's uh, published by Banipal Publishers and I forgot to tell you I'm also the Poet Laureate. I currently I'm the Poet Laureate of the Netherlands. I'll be in function until the end of January so we choose our Poet Laureate for four years. So I have been writing lots and lots of poetry about national issues, um, Dutch identity. Um, we had some difficult times. <laughs> We're experiencing some difficult times in the Netherlands. Uh, we are having an identity uh, crisis, cultural crisis, financial crisis. Um, so happy times in the Netherlands and it's uh, good enough to write about. Ramsey, now that, tell me, what do you hope, expect, fear, whatever, about with this festival high impact? I mean, do you, you're going to go to six different cities, you're going to go around England. Um, do you know the UK well already? I'm, and I must say, I don't know the UK very well, but I, every time I'm there, I fall in love with it. Um, I really like the people, I like the... the I like what I see so far, but I must say I'm not an expert and I would like to see and encounter more of uh, British life, British literature. I know some old uh, writers, old, old, old English writers, but um, I'm not too familiar with it. So I'm very curious what we will encounter. It will be hard, day, uh, hard day's work uh, as well, but we will be in... Uh, one city, one venue every every night, a new venue. How well do you think Dutch writing is known in the UK? Do you worry that people may have problems or you just... Well, I think the Dutch don't have any right to complain because we're only with very few, 17 million, not even 70 million people, in uh, 70 million inhabitants. So I think we... We don't have any reason to complain because already all these works have been translated into English, all the, the work of our uh, companions on this tour. But there are a lot of writers, Dutch writers, who are still unknown. And I think it's a blessing to be translated. I, when I first brought out my, uh, had my heavenly life, so this volume of poetry published, when I had it in my hands, it was for me much more, I felt much more. Um, it was really pure happiness, I felt, because it made me realize I exist. It is my passport into literature, this book. Because publishing is a way of existing, writing is a way of existing, but to be published in a foreign language, let alone, let alone to be published in English, I mean, which is the lingua franca uh, in, the, in this world, it is like feeling that you actually exist. I consider it my passport into literature. So I, I really am very happy and I feel rather blessed, uh, especially poetry, poets, po poetry to be translated into any other language is like, uh, well, it's, it's not very common, so I feel very happy about it.